This is the brand new Sheds three-in-one moving head. We're gonna get into this. Shout out the people at Sheds Lighting. This thing is fire. I cannot wait to show you this. I'm gonna give you kind of a rundown of what it looks like, but today we're just getting into the unboxing of the Sheds. 160 watt, three-in-one moving head. Let's go. All right, so they just sent this out and we're gonna unbox this guy for you and we're gonna see what it's all about and then I'm gonna have another video showing and testing this unit, so stay tuned. But without any further ado. All right, here we go. We got our little instruction book. Sheds, S-H-E-H-D-S. -E Make any stage the big stage. It's obviously powered by power con, so important to know if you don't have any power cons, very important. Then you got a one, one, two DMX cable. All right, so off the hop, it just literally came out the box. Um, I'm not a huge fan of that, but that's okay. It's obviously very secure, just in the box, and we should be good to go. So that should pretty well be it. And here she is in all of her glory. This is a 160 watt moving head light. You can do moving head, spotlight, and beam functions. So I feel like this is gonna be a really good light. We're going to get into programming this thing and I'm gonna show you guys what this thing can do. But from what I know, this is a really seriously sick light. Has 360 spin, total mover capabilities. You've obviously got all of your DMX settings in the front here. Uh, this is not bad buttons either. I actually had a friend who just got some similar lights from a Chinese reseller and the, the buttons on it were no good. Like I was not a fan at all of these buttons. I would have been really pissed. And I thought they were gonna be very similar cause they look the same, but these already feel a lot better. His are like, you can tell that after 10 pushes, this thing is, you're just gonna puncture it right through. So it feels good. It's solid, very solid. Feels good. The swivel is moving well. On the back, obviously, you got your power con, you got your power in, your power out, your DMX in, and your DMX out. So depending what you use for settings, myself, I just have Donner wireless dongles. So I'll just be plugging that in, but you're always gonna have to power them. You gotta make sure you got some power con cables. Obviously, this one comes with it, but a lot of people don't have power con cables. So make sure you got some. You're definitely gonna need like an extension cable or something, this is a very short cable. So make sure you got that. Then you just got your DMX cables. But again, myself, I use Donner wireless DMX, so you don't need wireless cables at all. But if you did, you would plug this in. And then with DMX lighting, pretty well, um, this will always, it'll kind of daisy chain itself to the next light. So when you're creating a lighting show, every single light that you're gonna have goes into a daisy chain. And depending how many channels that the light that you have has, that's gonna dictate like what goes into what. So if this was like say a 24 channel light, you would set this to one to 20, Four, then you plug this into the next light and then that next light would start at 25 for the DMX addressing. I think DMX is something that we're really gonna have to dig into. I've had a lot of people asking me about DMX, so I don't mind at all teaching you guys. Honestly, I'm not the smartest person about it. I personally use sound switch because it's kind of all done for you. So I really recommend that you guys are all DJs. Sound switch is like Serato. It was built by DJs for DJs. It plugs right into your Serato, everything's good, one USB and you're good to go. Depending how much work you really wanna put into sound switch, that's gonna kinda of dictate the level of show that you wanna create. But for me, I just have it all like basic setup, one setup done one time, and people are still kinda of like, wow, this lighting is incredible. And in the back of my head, I'm always thinking like, I set this thing up in like 20 minutes. I've never touched it again. Very basic, but you know, that's how it is. As long as everything looks good, your clients are gonna be happy. So I cannot wait. We're gonna be testing this thing out soon. We're gonna see what kind of functions this has, what the three in one can do. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys stay tuned. So far, I'm impressed with this light. Shout out my people at Sheds. The LED 160 three in one Gobo. And unfortunately it is not waterproof, so this is not a waterproof light. 
Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Join the private group if you're looking to really level your DJ career up. We just had our first mastermind with all our members. It was incredible. They learned a lot. Our next one is coming up next month. Do not miss that. It is included free with your membership. If you are struggling at all with your DJ career, join the DJ Connect, join the next mastermind, and get your questions answered. Let's go. Thank <laughs> you.